Show me making those barbecue burgers I told y'all about. But first things first, I must wash my hands. So always wash your hands, you gotta be sanitary. So So, washing my hands. First things first, we want to heat up the skillet. By the way, here's the burgers we're going to be making. There's four in this pack. So let me move this out of the way. Okay, and remove that. Okay, this is our skillet again. What we'll be using. Plug it in. Oh, and it's only gonna take a few seconds to heat up, and we'll have our burgers going. Now I'm gonna make um, the burgers with. Let's see. I'm gonna make a sauce. Well, a little bit. I'm gonna mix the ingredients together that I'm doing. Now, one day I would like to make my own barbecue sauce, homemade. One day I will. For now, I'm gonna use Kraft Honey barbecue sauce. So. Let me set this down for a second, guys. Okay. Put some barbecue sauce in here. Okay. Skillet still eating. barbecue sauce there but let's grab some other stuff I'm gonna grab some of this okay which if you didn't see it all the way barbecue you'll see it in and then definitely gonna need some of this okay and let's see what else we can eat garlic because I got a special thing for garlic later um well not really okay well I got something else I'm gonna make eventually alright so I'm just gonna do it like this there's the barbecue sauce right there alright the skillet looks like it's heated up enough so I washed my hands as you all seen. Okay, so first we're gonna throw the first burger on. I always hate when they have these little plastic things you gotta pull off, but yeah. Alright. Throw this one on. Okay. And throw this one on. Two burgers on right there. Okay. And there's another one here. And the last one. So there we go, there's four burgers there. We need a spatula. Yeah, we definitely need a spatula. So, there's our four burgers. Now, 
Sorry, I gotta set the time now for a second. Gotta do something. Gotta open these containers. Okay, so now, as we can see, I'm put some of this on there. Like I said, I use different spices and stuff because it makes it, it comes out tasting good and stuff, so, that's just what it is, man. Okay, so we got those on there. Now we're going to put a little bit of salt. So, just a very little. Okay. Now, I'm going to let that cook for a few seconds. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and start flipping these. Look at that. Put this one. I got one more to put. Yeah, I know I'm knocking the skillet into everything. <laughs> okay. This is not no famous recipe or nothing like that. It's just something I wanted to try. And I, like I said, usually when I cook, it comes out tasting good. Now, in the future, I'm going to cook some stuff that my brother knows, William. He knows a few recipes and stuff that he's, some he's even created himself. I mean, so, okay, one second. got to get our door real quick. See who's knocking at the door. What do you need, pal? What are you guys doing? I'm cooking dinner. Oh. Oh, he was telling me because he likes coming down. He was going to chat you about gaming and all that. Oh, well, wait. Just, I'll hit you up in a little bit, okay? Uh -huh. Alright, guys. Here's my neighbor at the door. Um, back to the burgers here. Big ass. So... And flip these again. Now, like my brother said, you don't want to add any extra um, oil, you know, vegetable oil to it because it kind of takes that flavor out. So uh, you want that burger taste. So yeah, look at that. Looks good. I'm going to get a plate because soon we're going to have to be putting these on a plate, on a plate. Yeah. But you're probably wondering by now, well, where's the barbecue at? You're going to see that right here in a minute. Just let these cook a little bit. These little morsels here. Okay, sorry guys, I'm trying to hold this. Uh, but so yeah. sometimes I like to take these little tiny pieces up, and they're good to munch on. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, there we go with that. Now, these are pre-made patties, but, of course, you can get a pack of hamburger and make them your own. And um, pretty much when you make your own hamburgers with, with um, you know, a pack of hamburger, you can add stuff to it like you want. Like you can put spices in it, you can put onions in it, you can put anything you want. You can put uh, fire red 
uh, peppers in it, habanero, anything, you, any kind of burger you want. And you just mix it in with the hamburger, pat it together into a patty, and then you fry it, you know, and comes out tasting really good. Now, I don't like onions and mushrooms myself, but there's very few, well, there's a lot of people out there that do, I mean, but there's few of us out there that just can't stand the taste of onions or mushrooms. Now, my brother William loves onions, um, so I'm pretty sure he would eat onions and stuff, but uh, on his, he'd probably be slicing one up or putting it into the burger or something like that. Now, he uh, does a lot of uh, League of Legends, and he did some Minecraft videos on a YouTube channel he had a while back. I don't know if he still has it or not. Um, but if you want to see his profiles on my Facebook, um, just I can't. I'm not gonna reveal the last name, but pretty much you just have to look for William, and you'll see what I'm talking about. You'll find him. I'll put it this way: he's got a girlfriend, and um, she has a child. Um, so yeah. Burgers are getting almost done. Now, we're going to go ahead and add some of this barbecue sauce. Well, it'd be easier to spoon it out, wouldn't it? I'd, maybe I shouldn't even uh, put it in the thing, but like I said, you can do it however you want. Okay, so, take a spoon of this barbecue sauce here. Put it right there on top of the burger. Uh, rub that around in it. Like that. I'm going to take another one. Now a lot of people don't use barbecue sauce on their burgers and stuff. They put mustard and ketchup and mayonnaise and relish and whatever else you want, you know. But, I mean, I've never tried this before and... I think it'd be good to try new things, you know? I mean, some meals are worth actually trying real good and stuff. And, um, but yeah, I mean, like I told you in my last video, I learned stuff from Food Network. I mean, some of my brothers even taught me some things. Like my brother Scott, he taught me about a Reuben. You know, I've never had the Reuben sandwich until he cooked one, and it was really good. I mean, it involves um, Thousand Island dressing. Um, I'm pretty sure it, it's it got sauerkraut in it, and I know you use marble rye, and um, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if it's roast beef or ham or whatever, but I'm pretty sure it's roast beef. And... Yeah, that's your Reuben and stuff, so. Okay. Now we're going to absorb this flavor in there, like that. Flip this. Whew, that grease is popping. Mm, turn this down a little bit. Hold on one second, you guys. Okay, one second, guys. Go one second real quick. Same time and stuff. Uh, once I get my camcorder and stuff uh, back from my um, mom and then when they're done using it, um, I'll um, it'll be a lot easier for me to cook that way. I'm gonna unplug it. I'm gonna let it sit there for a second. Let it absorb all that flavor. Let's flip 
this one. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Oh. Man, that, that looks so good. Let me tell you guys, it really does. We're going to try it out here in a few minutes. start spooning them off here. Now the reason I'm not putting it on paper towels right now is because uh, I don't want it to stick to the burger, you know what I'm saying? So I might put the paper towel over it and absorb some of the grease a little bit at least. So, okay. Uh, da -da -da -da. And then you just give a little pat here, you know, pat it down a little bit. You don't want to pat it too much because you don't want to take all your barbecue sauce off of it. I let the barbecue sauce cook in it a little bit too. So anyways, that's the barbecue burgers and I'm going to go ahead and grab some, oh, uh, I'm not done with the video yet. There's something else I want to do real quick. So here we go guys. Shout out to my brother William and his girlfriend Lizzie and Chloe. How you doing, Chloe? Yep, that's just pretty awesome, man. I'll give a shout out. Oh, I'm gonna move this camera so you get a shout out to Kenyon, my nephew. Hey, buddy. Now, got all that on the way. several other shout outs to this stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and all right, sorry about that guys. I'm gonna go ahead and do this now. <coughs> I'm gonna see if I can like set this up against something so that I can keep the phone up a little bit. <coughs> Wait a minute. Might be able to do it this way. about that. <laughs> Didn't mean to take a fall there. <coughs> yep. Anyways, <laughs> sorry about that. And like I said, I'm sorry I have to move the camera around a lot, but you know, have to hold it. So, okay. What is this right here? Exactly what I needed. Thank everybody again for, for subscribing to my channel. I really like that and I enjoy it. So, um, when these are done, I'm going to show you what I'm going to do next. Well, you pretty much get the idea already for what I'm going to do. But, yeah. my 
Come on, it's right there. There's my plan. All right. Now, I'm going to go ahead and turn this like this. Yeah, you are going to see up my nose and stuff. I'm sorry. But, it's up there. Yeah, it's hot. Very hot. Okay. And as you can see, we're in the middle. Ready? Scan. side, you know, you don't want it too much. Okay, and then just a little bit of this. Okay. And then here comes the best part, guys. The very best part. I've seen normal items on the top of the bun, but it doesn't matter. I mean, you know. So, um, I'm a very sanitary person, so I'm not going to use my hands. I'm going to grab it like this. Grab one of these nice, juicy, big ass. Put it right there. Slap the little. Sorry about that, guys. Put it right there on the bun. Oh, and um, it's got barbecue sauce on it, but you can add something else with it if you want. But I think I'm just going to do it like this. I mean, like, you put mustard on it or ketchup, too, if you want, and it all goes good together. So let's try it. Mm. Oh, my God. That is good, guys. That is very good. Try it out. I mean, that tastes really fucking good. All right. So, anyways, that was my cooking video. My second one. Trying out some new stuff. So like, subscribe, favorite, hit me up on Facebook, I'm going to go enjoy some burgers and stuff, and like I said guys, I hope you enjoyed it, sorry for all the moving and stuff, um, but yeah, like, subscribe, favorite, and I'll see y'all in the next video, whoop whoop, my fire lad.